Sziasztok! Én Bercek 111 vagyok, és ez itt a The Walking Dead Season 1 végigjátszásának első része. Az epizód 1-nek az első fele fog valószínűleg most ebbe a videóba belekerülni. Nem is húzom tovább a szót, hát nézzük, hogy mit tartogat a játék. Um, nem kell nekünk semmilyen új játék, ez az. Igen. Én normálan maradok. Egy új nap epizód segítség. Ja. Na hát persze, hogy az első epizóddal indulunk. Na nézzük. Magyar felirat lesz az a játék. Igen. Ezt azért még én is tudom. A játékról. Tiltale Games Presence. Skybound Entertainment. The Walking Dead. Hú. Na. Annyit tudok a sztoriról, hogy egy... Látszik, első epizód egy új nap, hogy éppen egy börtönbe tartunk. Bör, éppen börtönbe tartunk. Ezzel a Lee nevű fickóval. Kedves Lee. Na. Semmi szó. Does it really matter? Nah, not much. You know, I've driven a bunch of fellas down to this prison. Lord knows how many. Usually, it's about now I get the I didn't do it. And what do you say? I say, yep, I know you did. I followed the case a little bit, you being a making boy and all. You're from making me. Yep, came up to Atlanta to be a city cop in the 70s. I always wanted to work a murder case, like that senatorial mess you got yourself mixed up in, with all due respect. A real shame that is. Oh. Hell, the whole family used to be regulars at your folks' drugstore right in downtown. Still there? Sure is. Good. No. You want to know how I see it? I got much choice. Sure don't. Regardless, could be you just married the wrong woman. Seem important to you? All of them. That box never shuts up. Sit in this seat and pay too much attention and you drive yourself crazy. Oh, Rishtan. Me as a shock render. I'm driving this man once. He he was the worst one. He wouldn't stop going on about how he didn't do it. He was an older fella, big soft eyes behind a pair of smart folk glasses. And he just wailing back there. Said it wasn't him. Crying and snotting all over, right where you sit. Then before long, he starts kicking the back of the seat like like a fussy baby on an airplane. Not telling him he's got to stop. That's government property. 
and I'll be forced to zap him otherwise. So he stops, and having exhausted all his options, he starts crying out for his mama. Mama, it's all a big mistake. It wasn't me. So did he do it? They caught the fucker red-handed, stabbing his wife, cutting her up as the boys came through the door. He sits in my car screaming bloody murder that it wasn't him. I think he actually believed it himself. It goes to show, people will up and go mad when they believe their life is over. I got another good one for you. This one's a little bit less... Hey, 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 what's up me? Me, Opa! This other time... Bekezdett a játék. Nagyon. Aztán meg. Na, mi történhetett? Szerencsére élünk. Ezt kérdezem. Na mi a? Ja. Ah. Rúgjuk. Jó, ez nem fog semmit se érni. Egyet? De. Jó. Nézd ki az ablakon. Bébén együtt használva. Aha. Görgővel. Jó. Na, mi lesz most? Uuuuh. Használd a vélmi lentyűt, hogy kius. Sörétes. Sörétes lőszer. Felszik a sörétes puskát is. Na miért ne? Üresnek néz ki, ott volt a töltény. Aha. És akkor az előleg itt lesz, nem? Officer? God damn. Officer? God damn. Jó, ez többet nem mond. Nem lehet valahol már máshova jön. Na. Vegyük el a kulcsokat. Ne! Na. Jó van. Tök jó. Ezt is kibilincseljük. Úristen! Mit csinálja? Ja, es hátra, hogy elmenek ki. Sörétes puska, balról van. Balról van. Edd már fel. Nagyszerű. Töltsd be a lőszert. Na, ne! Hogy lehetsz ilyen, Bénali? 
Dölts már be! Oj! Hogy kell? Na, turancsuk szét a fejét. Lag volt. Hú, micsoda FPS lag volt. Na most minden zombi ide jön. <gül> Úgy látszik, nem. Az ott ki? Ne fussál már el! Menni kell, menni kell! Mit kell csinálni? Úristen, ne béna vagy! Nem fogunk hallni. Nem, nem, nem fogunk, nem. Na, valaki már lövi őket. Jó, elmennek. Nagyszerű. Okay, Help! Ah, I should just check inside the house through the glass door before wandering out into the neighborhood. Coming in. Don't shoot, okay? Na, here's a new situation. Hello. I'm not an intruder. I'm one of them. Ooh. At it, me too, Artent. Kifestő. Na. Itt akkor egy gyerek van, akit ott látunk, az egy gyerek. Vértócsa. Hát az az. Fú, de véna. Pohár víz. Azt mondta, hogy szomja, szóval se biztos, jó? Nem is oda. Jó. Elraktuk a walkie-talkit. Semmi. Sitter. 
üzenet traduzitor. Jo, jo. Hi, new messages. Message 1, left at 5.43 p.m. Hey, Sandra, this is Diana. We're still in Savannah. Uh, Ed had a little incident with some crazy guy near the hotel, so we had to get him back to the ER and have it checked out. Anyway, he's not feeling well enough to drive back tonight, so we're staying an extra day. Thanks so much for looking after Clementine, and I promise we'll be back in time before the spring break. Message 2. Left at 11.19 p.m. Oh my god, finally. I don't know if you tried to reach us. All, all the calls are getting dropped. They're not letting us leave and aren't telling us anything about Atlanta. Please, please, just leave the city and take Clementine with you back to Murrieta. I've, I've got to get back to the hospital. Please let me know that you're safe. Message 3, left at 6.51 a.m. Clementine, baby, if you can hear this, call the police. This 911. We love you. Good. <coughs> Is key? No, who is that? What's your name? I'm Clementine. This is my house. Hi, Clementine. I'm Lee. How old are you? Eight. Oh, the again. You're all alone? Yes. I don't know where anybody is. How old are you? I'm, uh, 37. Okay. Where are your parents? They took a trip and left me with Sandra. They're in Savannah, I think. Where the boats are? Are you safe? I'm outside in my treehouse. They can't get in. That's smart. See? Can you see me? I can see you through the window. It's me! What is that? As a babysitter! Good, good, can you me? Yeah, you me. Ed! It's, it's, now it goes, mash or yara! Look, bella, I did. Nice, sir. You yes, why? What I call a pasha kazeba? Os kellős a kalapács! Os kellős a kalapács! Na, még egy gyerek! Did you kill it? Yes. It's okay. I think she was a monster. Yeah, I think so too. You've been all by yourself through this? Yeah. I want my parents to come home now. I think that might be a little while. You know? Oh. Look. I don't know what happened. But I'll look after you till then. What should we do now? Tension on it, let me get an option to check. Can I show me a little bit of the attack now? We need to get out of this neighborhood. It's not safe. We're less likely to be seen if we move at night. My parents might come home. We won't go far. 
Try to find shelter and come back here with others. That sounds good. We can hide in my treehouse until then. It'll be a tough climb with this leg, but that's a good idea. Let's go. Stay close to me. No. May shut it to that. Now let's stay quiet. We'll head out to the front yard and follow the road out of the neighborhood. Okay. It'll be okay. Stay near me. And we'll move as fast as we can. No. Well no mako kopum kaki manni. Hey um. You're not one of those things. Neither of us are. Oh, damn, you've got a little girl. We're sorry about that. Well, Andre's sorry about that. It's Officer Mitchell. Michelle. My name's Sean. Sean, Sean Green. This is Andre. Officer Mitchell. Did you see any of those things? One of them just got our buddy Chet. I saw a lot in the forest, but... Yeah, one we're looking for is still in the neighborhood. Oh shit, you hurt your leg pretty bad. Look, help us find the Finish. thing that got our buddy, and we'll take you and your daughter down to my dad's farm to safety. He should be able to fix your leg up too. I'm not a dad. I'm just some guy. A dad who can fix some you? guy. Yeah. She's alone. Whoever you are, let's get a move on. We just w Oh shit! It's Chet! Let's go! Get to my car! Go! Chat! Chat zombie baby! No, it's a Tokyo girl. Sorry, Sean. Chet was a good dude. One of the best. Take care of you two. Thank God you're okay. Hold on. I was worried it'd be bad here, too. Been quiet as usual the past couple days. I reckon down the way thinks his mare's gone lame, but that ain't nothing new. I ran into Andre outside of the Chet, he got killed. No, you're kidding. Those things got him. Dad, I don't know what's going on. I'm sorry, Sean. You brought a couple guests. Your boy's a lifesaver. Glad he could be a help to somebody. So it's just you and your daughter then? Oh, not his daughter. He's, well, just some guy who found her alone. Honey, do you know this man? Yes. Okay, then. Well, looks like you hurt your leg pretty bad there. 
Opa, Clementine, I gave you. You're doing so good. <laughs> I can help you out. Sean, run on in and check on your sister. You take a seat up on the porch and I'll go see what I have. Okay. Let's have a look. Yeah, this is swollen to hell. Yeah. Could be worse. That's what it sounds like. Seems like things got awful bad in the cities. What did you say your name was? It's Lee. Nice to meet you, Lee. I'm Herschel Green. Herschel Green. Akkor ez az apja lehet az show-nak, talán? Ja. I didn't catch your name, darling. Clem Clementine. Can't imagine what you've been through, Clementine. I'm looking after her until we uh, find her parents. Hey, Dad. So I'm thinking, yeah. first okay. thing tomorrow, we gotta reinforce the fence around the farm. But what happened to your friend? Maybe that's not a bad idea. It smells like... Yeah. I know what it smells like. Duty. <laughs> Duty. I miss my mom and dad. I bet, Clem. How far is Savannah? Pretty far. Oh, okay. Hey, get up. No. Oh, it's out. Well, you slept in a barn, little lady. Lucky you don't have spiders in your hair. <gasps> but I bet your daddy scared them all away, huh? I'm uh, not her dad. Babe, sleep. I'm Kenny. Dad, we're Kenny. The no, get it. We better get going, or we won't hear the end of it. Kenny. That's my boy, Ken Jr. We call Ken. him Doc, though. Gotcha. Doc? Yeah, nothing bothers him. Like water off a duck's back, you know? <laughs> That's a valuable trait lately. No kidding. But frankly, I Ken think it's because he's dumb gotcha. as a bag of hammers. Dad! But he makes up for it with enthusiasm. The word is you were on your way to Macon. My family's from there. Well, Macon's on the way, and personally, I'd appreciate the company of a guy who can knock a couple of heads together if he has to. No. I'll see what the girl would like. Ah, gotta consult the missus. I understand. Honey, Duck, this is Lee. And, uh, what's the girl's name? Clementine. Clementine. That is a very pretty name.
what those things can do out there, so the faster we get this fence up, the better. I want to build a fence. Yeah? Well, I need a good foreman. You can sit on the tractor and yell at me whenever I take a water break. On the tractor? Cool! Duck and I will hop to it. I can keep an eye on your little girl here on the porch. We can visit. No. Hey there, girls. You two actually look relaxed. I think we're doing just fine. Clementine was just telling me about first grade. Oh, uh, how's that? It's easy. Well, yeah. So, you good? Anyway, it's almost like we didn't see people eating each other for the past three days. It's peaceful. So, uh, what do you do when corpses aren't walking around? I'm a veterinarian back in Fort Lauderdale. Like oh, Marshall here, except more with dogs and cats and uh, not horses. What is it that you do, Lee? I used to teach up at the University of Georgia. We need to hope that we can go back to our jobs soon, Lee. Back to normal. It can't stay like this. was let go a little while back. That's too bad. Well, I hear people always clamor back to college after a big disaster. People don't want to die ignorant, I guess. How did you handle getting through the city? Kenny just drove. We passed so many people that needed help, and we just passed people over some. Just, just... Uh, it's okay. It's fine. You don't have to say anymore. I want to go home tomorrow. But even then, I can't take away the things we, the things Doc went through. Don't you want to go back to the moment before you knew about all of this? Anybody in their right mind would. Families, barbecues, beers with hmm. friends. All of those things. As he so loved. Things we live for, right? With those gone, point. Back in a bit. Okay, Lee. Kenny, see ya. Hey there, uh, Kenny. Need any help? No, I think I got it. Do you need any help? What do you mean? I mean in taking care of that little girl. You know what you're doing? You got kids of your own? Nah, nah, no, no kids. Would have liked one then. You know. How's your son doing? Good, I think. Kachi's got a sister up in Memphis. We were coming back from visiting her. We were in a gas station and some guy grabbed my boy. I thought he was kidnapping him. I was on the fucker in about two seconds and... Christ. Just lucky I was there. We saw a lot of bodies before we stumbled upon Herschel's. But we're a tough family, Lee. Ain't nothing gonna phase us. <laughs> so what's your family's plan? Get back on down to Lauderdale and let this mess get sorted out. Government will start handing out shots, and the National Guard will do its thing. On the odd chance things got too bad, we could hop on my boat, I guess. You've got a boat. I'm a commercial fisherman, catching mackerel, dolphin, whatever's biting and paying. Katya wouldn't be wild about it, but the boat's not that bad. Hmm. See you. It's not the most reliable pickup in the world, but it gets the job done. No, no, no. Seems like those two are getting along. Katya's good with her. I am. You are on that. I knew Katya was ish. You know how to drive it? Sure don't. I can give you a hell of a critique of the U.S. Farm Bill, though. I'm good.
How you doing, Doc? Good. I'm gonna drive the tractor. I'm the foreman. Lift with your back, Sean. Sean's still working on that fence. Hey, Lee. Need a hand? That'd be great. If you could cut those two bikes to length, that sure speed things up. No. Vagik. My dad doesn't know how bad it is. No, he doesn't. I saw a guy in Atlanta kill a kid. A boy. Just shot him right in the face. between the kid's eyes and pull the trigger. You don't see things like that. It's not like in the movies. They don't fall like you think. Did you have to do it? Do what? Kill. Have you had to off one yet? Oh. I had to shoot one. I could shoot one. Maybe. If it were far away. I'm just glad we're getting this fence built. Dad just wants to keep the family safe and thinks inviting people in is a bigger threat than whatever's out there. How about yours? How's your family? My brother and parents are in Macon. I hope. Oh man, I hope so too. Maybe it's not too bad there. That's probably all I need cut for now. Thanks. Sorry about your friend. Thanks. I appreciate it, man. Anyway, when you see my dad around, he might want some help in the barn. Yeah. The shots. How'd you get out of Atlanta? I got a ride and then I was in a wreck. I walked until your boy found me. Hmm. Well, you're no worse for wear. Uh, this farm's a nice plot of land. <laughs> Had you told me 20 years ago I'd still be doing this, I would have told you that you were full of crap. Never was a plan, having a place like this. It was in the family, and I guess so was I. Family's important all that matters. Do you agree with that? Was brought up to? Yes. Yeah. Where's your family now? Parents? Me that my, yes, kid, is he? my parents are in Macon with my brother. Well, I hope they're all right. But now you've got this little girl to take care of. Clementine, is it? You just stumbled up on her? Yeah. I was looking for help in her house. Can I give you a piece of advice? Sure. I don't know who you are or what you did. Let's say things don't get better back in the cities, or they get worse before they do. You're gonna have to depend on the honesty of strangers if you're gonna make it. And if those same people get to questioning yours, you're gonna be in trouble. But at least you have the common sense to listen to a man giving you advice. <laughs> Go! I'll get my gun.
Got that ride to make it if you want it. Who? Back as that. Back as that toy attic. Elegy. No. Szerintem ennek a résznek elég az. Ennyi. Az epizód egyből. És majd folytatjuk, természetesen. Ha tetszett nektek, dobjatok egy lájkot, és iratkozzatok fel a csatornámra. Köszönöm a figyelmeteket, sziasztok!